Whoa, he's gonna kill me. How's it going people? My name is Shadow and we're here again in Conan Exiles. Just before we get started I would like to say that this episode, I actually tried recording this episode uh, about three times over the past two days and this morning. Um, I was going to record Wednesday but I woke up at half seven in the morning to someone using a jigsaw on the floor for about five hours so there was no way I was able to record and then yesterday it was just a load of hammering i don't know what was going on i'm guessing it is something to do with the floor the skirt and board. i don't know something to do with upstairs and today kind of like the same thing but it was on and off so i was like okay sweet i can start recording i hit record started doing things for about 10 minutes and then it just started i literally stopped and quiet was quiet for a good five minutes and yeah the mic was picking up really bad so it's to the point of i couldn't even like you know do anything but we're doing this now everything's all quiet down i've even went to the shop and saw the builders they've or whoever it was no white vans outside so they disappeared but they've got a load of stuff under the stairs so i'm guessing they're going to be back tomorrow but what we're doing today i had a thought i'm going to go and see uh if these hearts are actually the correct hearts for the imp cave which is all the way down here somewhere um i know it's near new river there's literally there's a cave here somewhere um can't remember exactly where but yeah i know it's there somewhere also uh this cave up here still didn't give me the uh location i did go up there again and yeah it's still not giving me the location but i know that there's a cave there i've looked up on the actual map itself and there is meant to be a marker there but it's just conan being conan so, I've got the horse following me, I have my weapons, I'm going to be using the Reaver's Axe today, not the uh, Limmer Moon. Um, I just want to see how this holds up because of the armor penetration. I mean, that thing's got 67 armor penetration, but it's a two-handed. I just want to see how this thing is actually going to hold it out and see if it does any better. So, I've got the food, got my buffs, got my heals, got the hearts got the horse following me because this is going to be a long run and the closest place for me to go down to is i believe yeah there the arena yeah so let's get down there come on horse get out of the corruption sweet why am i losing corruption i haven't got a perker hidden ability have i about losing corruption i mean the the this doesn't do it, does it? No, but I have noticed since I've worn this, that does pop up. But I've got 699 out of 700 health, so yeah, it clearly has affected me. I wonder if we're going to get the event that happens outside the summoning place today. If it drops in, I will definitely do it. Is it going to happen? New. No. This one's only popped up for me once. We've, I know we've had one before. Where was it? Yeah, one. I know one happened there before. Um, I think it was on camera. We had one outside the den. That was it. And since that, we haven't had any others. So obviously we've got one at the den. We've got one at the summoning place or when it decides to actually activate. If anyone knows where those events actually spawn, if it is actually outside the main camps for the uh specific races or clans should i say bloody horse go on get out the rock yeah because obviously like i said there's an event that happens out here and we've had an event happen here before we haven't had one outside new azagarth and i've been around mans of the dead so many times that if there was one meant to happen there it's not popped up but I'm just wondering if the den and the summoning place are the only places that have these events that happen. I'm not too sure if the black, if one's going to happen around the black galley and black hand. Why have I still got a bedroll up there? All right, yeah, because the black hand. Yeah, yeah. If it is those, just those two places, let me know. And I can't remember 
what special stuff you get from those events. And now I want to do another purge at some point. I need to go get a load of berserkers. Still haven't done it. I've been, uh, I've revisited Dragon Age Inquisition. It was on sale for a fiver for the entire game of the year edition, so I thought, why not? Right, how close am I to... Yeah, I swear it is opposite... No, I s yeah, I swear it's like there somewhere. So let's go get across to the river. Right, I know where I am... Ham? Yes, I know where I am. I know where I am right here. This is where I normally end up at. Uh, whenever I first start the game, I always seem to end up here for some reason. That's the cave! Yay, we made it! Right, horse, um, do me a favour and just stand guard there. Uh, hopefully you won't get attacked. Do deal with everything. Yeah, everything in here is going to die pretty quickly. Where's the red ones? Can't remember if there's red ones in this. I remember as well that this this was going back years and years ago, back when the game was still in game preview. The volatile glands. You could only get them from the was it volatile glands? I think it was volatile glands. Yeah, the only place you could get them was from the red imps, the exploding imps. Honestly, that was that took the piss. Demon blood. Enough of it. All right. Not that I need these buffs, but I'll take them anyway. Um. <laughs> I am not going to need my shield. Yet, anyway. Right, I believe this is the cave. Is it even... No, I, I, honestly, I don't know what's going on with Kona. Alright, where's the Imp King? There he is. Or one of the Imp Kings. Yeah, go away. There's an imp king that, that actually just sits uh, on a hill, I think. Right there. He literally just, he's just there with a couple of imps around him. Don't know if you give me anything good, though. An iron pot. That decoration. Th yeah, decoration thing, yeah. Okay. Alright. Now uh, we just need to get to... The other side. Step on to, to the other side. Ah. Uh, where did what that go? Why? Since when does that happen? Yeah, that's where we need to get to. And I'm hoping the hearts that I have are for this. I know he gives you a heart as well. Hello! <laughs> Hey, how much health you got? 2,000, okay. And he's dead! Right, what have you got for me? A withered heart. Staff of Haluman. Nice. That actually does look pretty decent. Uh, put that there for the moment. I want to take a look at it. And Silent and Legion Pauldrons. Lovely. Um, you give me anything. No. Okay. Right. Read the book. Others may have perished a long time ago, but I will remain. My loyalty will not be swayed by the disgust feeble creatures in this cave nor will the lack of food or clean water dismay me even a little Hanuman's test I know it, I will be rewarded given time ah that's what it is you get um ah what's it called uh, Hanuman's gift I think it's called with this, alright let's see there we go Hanuman's gift sacrifice accepted yep do not, right what is it not Oh, it gave me four Hanuman's gift. What was the other thing that he gave you? 
there was two different things that you can get. You get Hanuman's gift, and there's another thing, the main thing that you go for. I've just noticed there's the book stood th right there. O oh Lord of the Darkness, of men who are not men, give us strength and suffering in equal measure. Let our bodies be pleasing to you, and our minds quieted from this conscious thought. Let us find the inner rages and loose them upon the earth. We give our sacrifice into your hands. Appease your thirst in the slickness of blood. Grant us the power of your might, the eternal strength of Hanuman. Alright, that's what we get. Uh, Hanuman's boon. I've literally just looked up right here. Obviously, uh, human hearts, 100% chance, and you get Hanuman's gift. Withered Hearts give you a 20% chance to get Boon of the Gorilla. King Heart of the Kin Scourge has a 20% chance to give you Boon of the Grey Ape. Heart of a Hero, 20% chance for Boon of the Silverback. Uh, Heart of Nordheimer, 20% chance for Boon of the Yeti. And uh, Heart of the Sands or the Scourge Stone, 20% chance for Boon of Black Yeti. No idea what these are. Let me have a look. Ah, they're pets. That explains it now. I, 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 I always tried to think where... I, I've seen people with a yeti. I never knew where you got it. Clearly it's this. You bring your hearts and... Yeah. You... Give them to there. So, yeah, this is... I believe it's meant to be called Hanuman's Grotto. But Conan's being Conan and not telling me where anything is. And I've only been recording for 15 minutes as well, so where do I go? What do I do? Well, people, I have a lovely bit of news for you. I have actually just compared my map to the Conan's interactive map. And it turns out that I have been nearly, nearly, not 100%, I'd say about 85 to 90%, been everywhere on the map. Ah, there we go, it's giving it to me again. Ah, uh, is... What is going on with the colour? Has the sandstorm just been through, or is there one about to come through? Yeah, I have been nearly everywhere on the map. There are just a few, like, POIs dotted around this place as well. Um, all of this is done. A couple, pla couple POIs up here. You know, these eyes. Same with up here. I know there's, I think there's about three or four places up here that I've missed. I know there's something there. A couple things here. So you got the savannah with the Lion King rock right in the middle. I love that Easter egg. So, I wasn't planning on doing it today, but... Um... Prayer to Hanamanda. Do I really need to be carrying that anymore? Right. What effect are you going to give me? You gave me follow it. Oh my god, I've just lost my, um, I've just lost my carry buff. Damn it. Horse, do me a favour. Uh, hold on to that. Actually, hold on to all of that. Not like I'm gonna need it. Oh yeah, this weapon, what was it? It says spear. Or. Oh. Hold on. Legendary weapon, reach and concussive. Well, I'm gonna keep it because come chapter three, which is in a couple days. All of the legendaries apparently getting their own unique uh, set of moves to do, which that'd be interesting. Right, oh, so you're following me. Where am I gonna go? Well, either way, the uh, map room is up here next to the sinkhole. Let's run up past the summoning place. If the event doesn't happen there, then I don't know, I'll, go prob I'll probably go fight the arena dragon one more time or something. Military, like I've said before, if there is anywhere that you want me to go to or, you know, somewhere for me to go to and explore, because, like, I've checked my map, I've been nearly everywhere. So, I'm running out of places to go to, running out of things to do. And like I've said in one of the episodes, we have every single piece that we need right now to go and make the keystone and finish the game. I don't want to be doing that yet though because I want to wait for um, chapter 3 
so we can have a play around with some of that stuff before I complete the game. Because I do want to do that, uh, the raid on the uh, Stygian camp, Stygian castle, or whatever it is that they were planning on having us do. I mean, I know the main thing I want to do is build a tavern. I don't know if it's literally going to be a, like, building sized thing that you can place down or if it's like um if it's anything like the tavern table bar table that they have down in Sepameru. the one that doesn't like to blow in whenever you go down there for some reason is we going to have an event yes no No, I, I've really wanted this event to happen. Oh, like I said, I could probably go and do battle the dragon again. That's a fun fight, isn't it? I don't know. Yes. Yeah, why not? Let's just go down there. It's something to do. And apart from the arena champion that was in the... Uh, what the name of the place? We'll make a sanctuary. That was it. Um, yeah, apart from her, the dragon here in the arena was probably the hardest fight I've had so far I think. If we want to go hard fights that I've had to run away from the giant snake in there I haven't been able to beat it uh, you know what why don't I deal with that first I can't remember I know you give me reptile hide but you give me leather No, you do not. I need some leather. Ah, uh, just give me some fibers and some sticks, whatever. Oh, wait, I do have pipe. Oh. You're blind, Shadow, you're blind. Alright, give me that. I might come in handy for something. Alright, of course. Um, yeah, stand guard. Stay there. Ah. Uh, do that, do that. And then put that back. No, what was that? There. Was it that one? I've only got two of them left. Oh well. Right, let's see if we can actually deal with the snake this time. Is it going to be dark, dark? Let me up. Am I going to have to pull my torch out? Maybe. Uh. Ah, that's all the little ones dealt with. Right, yo! Just give me that, give me that, give me that. Yeah, this fight is... what? Using the same moves over and over again. Somehow, I am not losing this poison. There we go. And it appears to be able to hit you no matter what. Aim at the snake. Wasting potions here, come on. Is this the fight, is it? You do that, I attack twice. Is that how you're meant to deal with him? 
That is, that's ridiculous. But at least we killed it. The only other, um... Skeleton Kid, yeah, sweet. The only other, uh, enemy that I've struggled with is the giant, uh, rock nose things. Um, uh, last episode when I ran back, because I left you here, I ran down to here, obviously found Ice Chasm, Ice Spire Chasm. There is a giant rock nose thing, uh, there. But there is a boss up here, where is it? Circle of Swords, yeah, there's a boss up there. I forgot I forgot his name. Yeah, there's one of that one of him there as well. Might go and try and battle him at some point as well. Did they keep your legendary chest? Yes they did. What do we get? The Huntress, oh Lovely. Just what I wanted. Alright, if I knew I was coming in here as well, I would have brought some cleansing brews. Uh, I forgot they bloody stun you with every fucking move. Look, I can't even get a bloody hit off. Yeah, you don't like it when I bloody stun you, do ya? Frick. No, don't, don't, not. Uh, that thing has got an aggro range of a fucking wasp. Yeah, just run away! You know, you come after me and you run away. Piss off. Uh, I'm in here, so I might as well go and defeat the dragon again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello there. I think I've killed you like twice because there's one of you in the uh, Warmaker Sanctuary. Right. Um. Not that I need it, but let's go. Uh, let's give you a try. Why has he got a blue bar? Oh right, yeah, this does concussive damage as well, doesn't it? It's a bit of a weird combo to have. Oh. Remember his attacks. Remember his attacks. Remember his attacks. He is. Right, drink that. Get out, World Breaker. Whoa, he's gonna kill me. Get the axe out, get the axe out. No. I was holding LT as well. But I don't think it works. Bloody skeleton, go away. That is ridiculous. Yeah, 
yeah, as long as I can get some big hits out, I'm good. And he is dead for the third time. It is a real shame that he doesn't drop any bloody legendaries though. I know. Where was it? Where were we? Where were we? Where were we? Yeah, I was the Warmaker Sanctuary. Nearly every single boss in there was dropping a legendary, which was awesome. Um, give me your key. I said, give me your key. Does he not give you a key? I could have sworn he gives you a key. But oh, we got another Star of the Champion. I don't need it, so I'm dropping it. Um, print that. No. Drop that. That'll do. Right, anyway, people, I'm actually going to leave it there. Don't worry, I'm not logging off here. That would be a very stupid idea. Um, I will literally run up and go back to base. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here because um, I I honestly don't know what else to do. Uh, we went to Hanuman's Grotto. That took... That was quicker than I actually thought it would be. Um, and showing you about the uh, Hanuman's Gift, which I give to the horse. Uh, and that's got random effects on it. Obviously, as you can see, it um, gave me follower damage. That's just one of the effects. I don't know the rest of the effects, but it's just a random effect thing. Um, you mainly take the hearts down there to get the boons, so you gorilla, so you can get your gorillas or your yeti. Um, two yetis and two different gorillas, I think it was. And obviously, like I said, we just came to the arena. We finally defeated the snake. That thing almost killed me. It's honest, I hate fighting snakes in this game because they just use the same attack over and over and over again. And they the reach on them is ridiculous. And then we came and fought the dragon, the one enemy that I nearly struggled with. Came here with Bob last time, but Bob's dead. I need to go get more Bobs. I'll probably end up doing that at some point as well. But if there's anywhere you want me to go i mean this is the map as you can see i have been pretty much everywhere um or if there's a boss you want me to go uh fight and obviously we've got uh oh, no, i forgot the name of it i forgot the name of him again uh up at the circle of swords there's another one of him in ice casa ice ice spire chasm and there's one here i believe as well um but apart from that uh, I will probably just end up going through some of these journeys to finish them up. I don't know, obviously that, that's just going to be easy to do. Uh, Dungeon Delver, I need to go through Skelos, Sunken City, Silver Mine, Warmaker Sanctuary and Wine Cellar again. Those last two are going to piss me off because of the bosses at the end. Purge Defender, like I said, we need to do another purge. I need to go get some more bobs to sit down there. And then obviously just a load of random other things. Mountaineer, what was that? All right, yeah, climb finger, bang, rock. So yeah, I am literally running out of things to do on here. Uh, if anyone, like I said, anyone got any suggestions, let me know. But I am mainly just waiting for uh, chapter three just to see all the new stuff. And then we will end the series. And then I'll probably take a break for Christmas. I may do some odd videos here and there, um, but I'm going to start a new series. I'm going to start two different games, I think. I've got two games in mind to do. Anyway, people, thank you for joining me. And as always, my name is Man Shadow. I'm hoping you the rest of the day, the rest of your evening, wherever you are in the world. And I shall catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.